Hi, I'm Heidi Borchers. Have you seen my crunched tissue paper flowers? Just the name makes you giggle. I wanted to show you how to make leaves and calyx for these flowers because I wasn't able to show you in the video. Here's a bouquet of my crunched tissue paper flowers. I'm going to show you how to make the calyx, which is the green part behind the flower, and the leaves. I'm painting the white tissue paper. I found when I made my flowers, I didn't have any green tissue paper. So I thought, well, it would be really cool to paint it. I'm just using acrylic paint, and we're just going to spread some on the tissue paper. And I'm just using a squeegee to apply the paint. You can do color on color until you get the effect that you want. and set that aside to dry. For the leaves, I glued two thicknesses of the painted tissue together with the Aline's Fast Grab Tacky Spray. And then you can start cutting out your petals just by using a pattern. Place a little bit of the Aline's Tacky Glue down the center. And just place an 18 gauge wire in it and just push it around the wire. And there you have your leaf. For the back of the flower, which is called the calyx, I cut a little piece of the tissue paper, fold it in half, fold it in half again, and in half again, and then just cut kind of a curved point at the end. Open it up, and place some glue on it. go up on the points and then just stick it to the back of the flower. And sometimes I make it a little bit too long. If you do that, just cut off one of your pieces. This one looks perfect. Make sure you have all the points glued down. If you need to add a little bit more glue, you can do that. And just pinch it to the bottom of the flower. Next, we're ready to put the leaf onto the stem. And I'm just cut some strips of the tissue paper that I had already painted instead of the florist tape. I found recently florist tape, which has a wax base, didn't hold as well, so I wanted this to hold really well, and I th really think the effect of the painted tissue paper is really pretty. So put some glue on. And then just wrap it around to cover your other tissue. And just to get down a little bit and then add your leaf in and just include it into the where you're wrapping. And when you need to add more glue, just add it. And sometimes it will tear a little bit and I just keep squeezing it together. I just love the look of that painted tissue. And you can also add more than one leaf. Tear off the excess and adjust your leaf so you can see it. Perfect! I just love my crunch tissue paper flowers. You can make one, you can make a dozen. How about the vintage look for corsage? I'm Heidi Borchers and I think it's cool to craft.